Hey guys, my name is Astraya and welcome to another Create a Sim video. So I have actually just started a little mini series and if you can't guess or can't tell from the title or the thumbnail, I am going to be making over the course of the next three videos the three main Powerpuff Girls. So obviously I'm starting off with Bubbles and she is the youngest Powerpuff, Girls out, Powerpuff Girl out of the three and her colour is blue. So I try to keep that sort of theme throughout all of her outfits. They're not necessarily all like bright blue, but I try to keep things nice and light and pastel-y and if there's not blue in there, then there's sort of like an off-white almost. And from the original series, she also wears pigtails. So I've tried to sort of keep that as well in terms of the two different hairstyles or the two main hairstyles that I give her. So Bubbles, her personality is that she is the sweetest and the friendliest of the three Powerpuff Girls. She's also the youngest and she is a bubbly person. So she is the most friendly and the most outgoing and she is considered the sugar of the three. Apparently her secret ingredient when their dad was making them is sugar. So he put sugar into her and that is what makes her so sweet. But Bubbles is also apparently capable of extreme fits of rage, <laughs> which, is what allow, which is what enables her to fight evil to the same extent as her two sisters. So I thought that was a really fun character to try and play about with. In all of her outfits that I give her, I try and make her look like a nice, kind, sort of sweet, innocent girl. I also, she is a young adult sim but I have tried to make her look younger in terms of her fashion sense. So maybe just like on the very cusp of aging up from a teenager to a young adult because she is that little bit younger than her two sisters. I have made Blossom and Buttercup as well. And then while I was doing some research for the three Powerpuff Girls and I was looking them up on Google to get a, uh, an understanding or just to sort of refresh myself with their personalities. I also looked on Pinterest to, to look specifically at some fan art and some fan drawings of what people think they might look like when they've grown up. And I discovered that apparently there is now a fourth Powerpuff Girl and her name is Bliss and she has bright blue hair and she also wears purple so her colour is purple. I am considering whether or not to add her into this collection because I know that a lot of people that are watching this probably haven't watched Powerpuff Girls for a while, you know, part of your childhood because I believe it came out in 1998. That's when this, the series first started, so I'm sorry if that made anyone feel a little bit old. So it's quite an old series, but there was a revamp in 2016, I believe, and that is when the fourth Powerpuff Girl Bliss was introduced. So that's up to you guys. If you if that's something that you'd be interested in, if you would like to see me add her to this collection, then I would be happy to do so. So you could just let me know in the comments. That would be excellent. Or maybe give the video a like, and then that can sort of show me that you are interested in seeing that Powerpuff Girl turn into some as well. Because I do think it'd be quite interesting with the blue hair and the purple outfits. I think that could be quite cool. But that outfit that I've just finished, the like the workout clothes outfit is an example of the fact that there was nothing I was really happy with that was blue. So I went for like a sort of like a white outfit overall and I think that that worked out well. And I like how she had like the the like the shoulder warmer on and everything. I think she looked quite preppy and quite bubbly. <laughs> um, yeah, so I am actually really quite happy with how this sim turned out. I'd say that out of the three, she's probably my second favourite. Blossom definitely has ended up my favourite and because of that I'm gonna leave her till last so we'll wait and see how that goes. And I'm actually... I haven't uploaded in a while, it's been about a year since I uploaded consistently and I'm trying to get myself back onto a schedule. But over that year I took some, some serious breaks with playing The Sims as well and then when I came back I just made a, made a dream life and so like made my sim self and my boyfriend and just went straight into that sort of play style because that's usually how I play the sims. 
But because of that, I never really explored and looked through all of the new clothing options that we've gained from a lot of the packs and the updates that we've had. And I've been very pleasantly surprised to see all of the new stuff that's came in. Like, for example, the cold weather outfit that we're going on to just now. I love that jumper. I would wear that jumper. <laughs> and the t-shirt that she wears in her warm weather outfit. I really like that. Or the blouse that she wears in her warm weather outfit. And then the t-shirt that she wears in her party outfit. I just think that EA are doing well with the updates that they are giving us to all of the fashion and the clothing. So I'm pleased with that. I also, I think that her her formal dress is so cute. Kind of gives me like a little bit of, I know that it's obviously from Country Living, but it gives me some cottagecore vibes. And then put her hair up in a nice little braid and some nice wedgies. I just, I'm, I'm feeling it. I'm really, really enjoying this sim and rediscovering all of the new things that have been added into the sims. So yeah, this is the start of a little mini series as I've, as I've said. So this is Bubbles. I hope you like her. I hope that you think that she does the original character justice and that her outfits match the personality that should be going with her. Blossom and Buttercup are still to come and potentially Bliss, but additionally if any if you guys have any suggestions for another a future mini series, then I would be all ears down in the comments. I'm particularly interested in possibly moving on to the Winx characters. So like um is it Bloom and Stella and Flora? So I think that that could be interesting. I think I could do a good do a lot of fun things with them. Anyway, thank you guys so much for watching another video and for all of your support once again and hopefully I will see you in the next one. Bye guys!